Natasha, welcome back to my channel, and I hope you guys are having a great and wonderful day. And if you're new, hello and welcome, and hope you guys like my videos. Stay hit the subscribe button, the post notification icon, so it notifies you every time I upload a new video. So if you're seeing any tiredness, any puffiness, this is very much real, very much live. I woke up two minutes ago, and we're doing this like on the run. This is not pre-recorded, pretending that it's a school day. Like this is today, the school day. I usually have only one Zoom class per day, and that is for my French class, which is at eight o'clock Hawaii time, which is eleven o'clock here time so if it's 10 18 I have about less than an hour to get ready and show up open my screen and get into zoom so I strive to work out in the morning that's my thing if I cannot do it because I don't have time before class then I push it to either after class or later on in the day but usually when I show my morning worked out then we're ready to go, we're ready to go, you know? And because I don't have French class this morning and I'm doing all my other classes like on my own time, it's like personal study, then I can do my workout this morning. So we're gonna brush the teeth. Squeaky clean, not the full shebang, we'll do that a little bit later. This is just to like get that taste out of my mouth. Today's mantra, do whatever it takes to make it successful. Whatever you need to do today, get up, get smiling, get ready. If it's not your day today, you're gonna still get up, go to the bathroom, brush your teeth, go, go pee, wash your face, Go back to bed and if you have enough energy to do it again and do something else go ahead and do it but we're gonna go back to our room because it's time to work out okay so time to work out i usually don't like to eat before i work out or else my food is literally feeling it's like it's at my throat and i'm not that hungry like right straight off in the morning so i'm just gonna put on my workout clothes and do that we're just doing this for ourselves this year is for ourselves because the beginning of this year was a little rough so right now at the end of this year we're gonna end it strong and we're just gonna work on ourselves and our body I've been doing that for like the past two three weeks and it's been great so I'm gonna keep doing that so I'm gonna put on my workout gear on and we're gonna break a sweat I found a little mat if you guys didn't see I think it was either my last school video or something I said I was gonna buy a mat well there was one in the house so we're just gonna go ahead and use our resources also if you're wondering what workouts i'm doing because every time i say something about like workout videos everyone seems to want to know i'm doing right now the chloe ting 25 day hourglass challenge today i'm on day 18 of the calendar but i'm probably like on day like 25 of like actual calendar days because i have taken a lot of breaks and is it on purpose? Yes, because sometimes i wake up and i just don't want to work out and it happens but here we are as long as you made some effort that day you're great. I know I'm procrastinating this. You know what? Um, I woke up thinking that working out this morning was a good idea. Like I do every morning. And now that I'm here, I don't think it's such a good idea. But we're gonna click. We're gonna. We're gonna do it. We're, we're gonna do it. Workout is complete. I am sweating which means it's time to take a shower. If I work out in the morning, then I can get the sweat on and then shower and be good. So that's my main motivation that I get to shower because who doesn't love being squeaky clean? Okay, here we are. I had to turn off the music because um, copyright. Oh, what a great morning. What a great morning has been so far. Here's the thing. I saw this thing on Instagram and I thought it was like really true and I was like great mornings make great days and great days made great weeks. Easier said than done, right? Um, last week was, girl, girl, let me tell you last week, last week was a disaster, but we turned it around 360. We turned around 360 and we're gonna have a good week. But we're gonna brush our teeth again. Um, the first time I brushed my teeth was just kind of like to get the taste out of my mouth. But now we're doing the full having clean breath, like, cause that is very important. Teeth clean now, next flossing. Yes, if you have braces or if you have retainers like I do, I have like retainers on the bottom, like a little line and I'll stop retainers at the top. You wanna get in there, right? Um, I use these little things. Hope you can see it's like a little tube. So pretty much, let me just do a little quick one, two. You take one of these out, right? You grab your flowers. I took a lot today. Put it in the loop. Why am I teaching you how to floss? Y'all should be knowing how to floss. Here, floss tutorial. And then, you know, right here. So because you have a retainer that goes across here, you want to get the gunk out of like the bottom, like if there's a line, there's tooth at the top, tooth at the bottom. You wanna put the little thing in here and floss here at the bottom, cause you can get at the top with like the regular floss. But you do that, right? At the bottom, 
then you don't have like rocks in your teeth or like debris, not debris, all that calcium buildup. I think it's calcium. Flossing is one of those things you just gotta do. Let me tell you, when the difference that your breath smells when you don't floss versus when you do, astronomical. Astronomical, so floss today. Have you flossed today? Did you do it? Do it. Okay, now we're gonna gurgle, gurgle, gur gurgle, you know? My teeth feel so clean, I could slip and slide down them. Next thing is skincare. But first and foremost, you gotta wash your hands. I mean, my hands were already clean, but especially now that I'm touching my hand, you know why I feel about it. Touching your hand, dirty hands, clean face, blah, blah, blah. Wash your hands. For 20 seconds, there's a global pandemic, sis. Come on, do it, do it with me. How do we learn this in school? They're like, in, 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 and then other side, and then each finger. And you should be doing this every day, regardless. There's a virus out there. And even for those who don't think there's a virus up there, wash your hands, you dirty. Like, disgusting, just wash them. Like, I don't care if people, some people are like, no, the virus isn't real. I'm like, okay, if you were to think that, Wash your hands still, like don't be disgusting. Don't be dirty. And then you still protect us all. I just love the mornings. This morning routine is very chatty, but you know, the mornings is a time that you get to yourself to kind of like set the foundation for the rest of your day. Like if you take time in the morning to take care of yourself, I know I look ridiculous. If you take time in the morning to just like do a little pampering, take time in your skincare routine, take a little deep breath, then you're just like setting yourself for a good tone for the rest of the day. And yes, I do this in the morning, cause why not? You should too. Get the robes on Amazon, get the headband also on Amazon. I'll link them down below for those who are interested and just have you time. I don't care if it's 10 minutes or five minutes, just take some time, clean your face, brush your teeth, meditate a little gotta wash it off now and just take time to fuel yourself feel your body with positive energy this is what is going to get you through the day this i'm gonna do a twirl i'm gonna do a little dip Whoop. bend and snap you know this is what is going to get you through the day so if you're not starting with positive thoughts as much as your brain is telling you you're not going to do it today you're not going to get up you're not going to be successful all those things you're going to like push those to the side you're going to be like no 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 not me not today you're going to dodge them do a little matrix moment a little whoo, negative thoughts right and just take time to, in the morning to have a great time with yourself have a fun time have a blast play some music i would be playing music right now but you know copyright so yeah now i'm using uh niacinamide by the ordinary most important sunscreen i don't care how dark you are i don't care how light you are i don't care if it's sunny outside or if it's dark outside just put it on just put it on fantastic and my favorite part lip balm my the lips have been feeling dry since I started pressing record, but this is my last step, so. Oh, butter. Oh, butter. I always use the same products, but I still show you again and again in case you're new. Black-owned brand, favorite lip balm, awesome. Look at that. Mmm. We need some more. And that ends the bathroom portion of today's morning routine. So let's go and uh, let's get dressed. We're back in the bedroom. We're gonna do a little quick change, a little one-two step, and then we're gonna finish up our morning. Here we are, little lounge we're on. For today's OOTD, we got pajamas. Um, we love rocking the pajamas at home. They look awesome. And then I still have this thing in my hair because my hair takes forever to dry. So let's, let's have a little chat. Okay, so. Most of my classes in online school are asymphomous. I think that's what it's called, meaning that you have to do it on your own. I only have that one class that is symphomous, which means that you show up for it, and that is French. And because French is canceled today, that means all the classes I need to do today are asymphomous, and I only have two classes today. Hence why I took my sweet time in my morning routine, because I only have to do two classes and then the rest is just catch up if I want to, which I will be doing because the easy, the ease, the ease that you can fall behind in online school, astronomical, it's so easy to do it. So that is why I took my sweet time. So next thing is getting some fuel in this body. To be really honest, most days I don't eat breakfast. Life of a college student. I just get so busy. I do this whole routine and I go straight to school because I either have a class in the morning, like my French, or and then I just like keep going until I stop. So I just eat like a late lunch. So this is usually what I do now. So we're gonna go downstairs. 
Conclusion, we finish our morning eating breakfast. I either eat it outside, which is nice depending on the day. Most days it's too hot for me to be outside. Today is like just right, so that's why I'm outside. Or I'll eat it upstairs in my desk and then get straight into my work. But for today's breakfast, we have potatoes, carrots, mushroom, like spiced, and then a little piece of salmon on the top, whatever was left over from last night's dinner. And then as a drink, I have peach nest tea. Venezuelan peach nest tea. The superior type of nest tea. Just saying. Basically, this is where my morning ends. I take these last few minutes to just enjoy my breakfast. I just think and just like get my head in the right headspace to like bust out school. I'm just gonna take this time for myself, uh, put myself in that right positive headspace and get ready for school. Food is gone meaning that that concludes this morning routine because now i have to actually do school we love it positive attitude let's do it let's do it we're gonna get through the day and we're gonna have a great day you're gonna have a great day we're gonna have a great week month rest of the year positive thoughts positivity i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below on any video you guys want to see next don't forget to subscribe to this channel that's very important don't forget to follow me on my instagram at natasha.mather and we have some pretty good pics over there some cute 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 pictures so if you want to do that go ahead see you guys in my next video bye